What's up, everyone? It's Chris from PickDogs.com here with your free pick in the UNC Asheville versus Radford. College basketball matchup going down Thursday, December 29th, 2022. Before we get to that free pick, gotta let you guys know, PickDogs.com, we're doing it bigger and better than anyone else. Got more free pick videos on our channel than you'll find anywhere else on YouTube, so make sure you're subscribed. And also take advantage of our free sportsbook bonus offer, the link in the description of this video below. Also in the description of this video below, click the join button. For more information on our YouTube VIP and premium passes, great way to get yourself some premium content for an awesome price. The VIP and premium passes will ensure that every single day you're getting plays from myself, Mitch, and Rod. It's one of the best values going in sports handicapping today, so make sure it's something that you check out, take advantage of, and keep in your back pocket. But let's get to this one between UNC Asheville and Radford. And UNC Asheville coming into this game with a record of 8-5 and five on the year, 4-6-1 and one against the number. After ending up on the wrong side of an 85-51 to 51 loss at the hands of Arkansas on the road last time out. Meanwhile, Radford coming into this one with a record of 6-7 and seven on the year, but 7-3-1 and one against the number. After a fourth straight loss, but a loss to Kansas State by 8 points, 73-65. to 65. Good news for Radford, though, they were getting, or at least the good news for us if you had Radford, they were getting 16 points in that thing. And, and I'll be honest with you, I've been impressed with what Radford's done on the road. They did have a couple of pushes over the course of that, uh, a push over that course of that four-game win streak. Also, uh, managed to not cover and actually lose outright as eight-point favorites against VMI a couple of weeks ago. But again, covers as double-digit underdogs, losing by eight points to VCU and Kansas State, and a uh, push against Eastern Kentucky, not too shabby for Radford. A Radford team that's you know performed fairly well over the course of the season. Like I said, seven three and one against the spread. UNC Asheville's done a better job at winning games. Um, you know, against teams like East Tennessee State, South Carolina State. Didn't get the cover against Dayton, but again, it's, it's there was just a, a level of talent below uh, below Dayton for where UNC Asheville was. You just look at what UNC Asheville's done at home, though. They were favored against uh, UT Martin by 7.5, only won that game by 7. And whether it's by 1 point or 100, doesn't matter. A non-cover is a non-cover. And I just look at this matchup, and I think that Radford could keep this one close. Obviously, they're not going to get anywhere near as many points as they were getting against uh, against VCU and Kansas State. But Radford's earned my respect on the road, man. They're playing some solid basketball. I think they could keep this game close, potentially win it outright against UNC Asheville. So I'm going to take Radford plus the points in this one. I think this could be a two-point game if Radford doesn't win it outright. Give me the Highlanders, and that's going to be my free pick. But if you're looking for best bets for myself or any of our other world-class handicappers, check out Pick Dogs Premium. Use the promo code PICK. P-I-C-K, all one word, all lowercase, for 15% off your purchase of $25 or more at Pick Dogs Premium. And while you're at Pick Dogs, make sure you check out our free betting tools, some of the best betting tools in the business and tools that you'll want to make sure that you have in your back pocket when you're making your best bets for the day's action. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and drop a like. Let's cash some winners.